Nigerians are brazen for a partial lockdown from Thursday as authorities try to contain the spread of coronavirus cases in a country of about 200 million people. Markets, religious centers, schools, offices, leisure sports have already been shut in some states since last week. The country has 65 confirmed cases of coronavirus and has recorded one death. On Tuesday, Lagos, the nation's commercial capital, with an estimated population of 20 million, advised residents to stay at home and only permitted shops selling essential items like groceries, medicine and life-saving products to remain open. Our correspondent, Nimia Akambi, went out to the street and filed in this report. It is 4 p.m. and I'm here at the popular Eco Hotel Roundabout, famous for its traffic. And as you can see, the roads are free and traffic is light. And this is due to the lockdown imposed by the Lagos State Government due to the coronavirus. We spoke to a few Nigerians to know how they feel about the imposed lockdown. Well, it's uh, highly commendable. Actually, that's because uh, you know, Lagos State has so many borders, both, in, both on air and in land. And uh, Lagos State happens to be one of the major, the major entry points to the country, apart from Abuja and other states. And the population of Lagos State warrants that. So I, I actually commend the governor for, 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 that, for that move. It's very, very important that he do such a thing. Staying indoors is very, very important. Lagos State is highly populated. And staying indoors will help us in that. As it is highly populated, there is, there is that tendency and possibility that uh, 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 contacts will be made, hand, whatever will be made. So it's highly recommendable that he stays, that we stay indoors, and then there will be no, no movement and all of that. Because of the, the epidemic, it's a deadly virus. I think they are doing their best. It's a good idea for the entire Lagos state and the world as a whole. I feel bad because people are hungry, people are dying, left and right, no money, everything closed down. But what I want to say in this about this disease is that it's air time. Let everybody run to God. Because the Bible don't make us understand that if, yeah, if, um, um, if trumpets is about to blow, to, 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 yeah, it's about to, what is about to end, that, be, yeah, that many diseases will happen, many things will happen. And this, all the things that the Bible tells us, that is what is happening now. Well, I feel good about it, but the shutdown don't affect many people. But I see some people are still working. And I see some buses, I see carrying plenty of passengers full inside, which is not good. Because that means we are not safe with the coronavirus. So at least buses are supposed to carry like two, two passengers per seat to save our own life. It's for our own good. But since they are still carrying four at the back, four years, four years, I don't think it's working according to what they say the two should go around. The Lagos government's reaction to the coronavirus outbreak is commendable and many Lagosians are following the directive laws as otherwise busy areas are now deserted. For Plus TV Africa, Nimi Adekombi.